I am a dancer. 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 Sometimes I think I dance because that's the only thing I'm really good at and I've just done it for so long that that's just what I do. <laughs> and then there are other times that I really enjoy it, but I've had such a struggle with it for such a long time that it's not quite so clear to me why I've been so unhappy, yet I still continue to do this. But something kept on drawing me back every time, and I'm not really sure what it is. Or if it's just insecurity that maybe there's nothing else I can do better. What I consider success in this field is making a difference in people's lives. Just last summer, a mother and her daughter came backstage in tears from my performance. To me, that, that was just like my jaw dropped. I didn't know I, I could do something like that. That's what I want to keep on doing, and that's, that's continued success. That's when I don't feel guilty, don't feel like I'm being selfish by examining my lines in the mirror every day and, and, and just being so self-concerned about how I conserve my energy and all that. It becomes very selfish, and that doesn't seem successful. But when I can make a difference to others, when I can move others, that's success to me. This is my first injury. It was a complete tear. You know, I have this fear that I'm going to be afraid to do things. You know, it's kind of like when you're a little kid and like you have no fear and you'll go on the, all these roller coasters and you'll, and you'll try anything. And I always felt like I was like that in bad dance. There wasn't a movement I wouldn't try. Dan Dancing is one of those things where, you know, I know a lot of dancers don't want to say it, but you know, we like staying beautiful with the dancing. <laughs> and, um, you know, it keeps you like in such amazing shape and your mind is right. I was always told I was fat. I was part of a dance company and every weekend they would take me into a room with all the other company members and put me on a scale and they would tell me how fat I was and that I had to lose weight. Sometimes I really wonder what I contribute to the world. Sometimes I feel like I could just disappear and nobody would even notice. If you really have a dream, you should never give it up. Once you give up your dream, you give up your whole life. And if dancing's everything to you, nobody's going to get in your way and nobody can stop you.